Good day, folks. Pep and Benoni. We are here at uh, the Kedipiv um, Bradford site. Uh, here with me is the winner of the men's edit race, Bradley Scott. Brad, congrats, man. Thank you. Uh, about the race, man. How was it? Yo, from the beginning, we were we were four guys in our team. We managed to get three of us, including me, into a small breakaway of about eight guys. From there, we rolled all the way. We lost a few guys uh, until the, on the way. Yeah, and then with about 30 k's to go, a few more guys dropped back. There were lots of attacks. And then, say, in the last 20 k's, myself and uh, Kent Main broke away. I sat on his wheel until the finish, and we yeah, are able to sprint him at the end. Uh, yeah, it's a privilege to be here to take my first elite win. Um, and yeah, thanks for the sponsors, Team Pro Cycling Honeycomb. Yeah, it's been a privilege. Just tell me about um, the preparation when you're coming into this show. So what sort of training regimen did you, did you, you know, um, um, did you employ to come in here and tell you, you know, how to come up with the room? Yeah, so luckily it's close to the beginning of the year. We had a lot of um, excuse me, time in December to do lots of base miles. And you have some big races in the beginning of the year, provincial champs and then South African champs. So yeah, I think everyone has good legs now coming off those big races. So yeah, the preparation just sort of... Uh, falls down into these uh, smaller races. Yeah. Um, and then, um, for the past three years, the race has been, you know, so close. You know, they, they, they uh, number one and number two in the post by only seconds. This is however, you know, um, you guys took away AD and then uh, you just came in and won. When, when did you think, you know, um, in the course of the race that they will have it in the bed? Yeah, so I think, um, unfortunately this year, there are a few big uh, pro cycling teams. So the competition in the bunch is a little bit less. So with the strong guys going into the breakaway from the beginning of the race, there was less firepower in the bunch to bring back the break. So yeah, from the beginning, three of our, my teammates, including myself, were in the break. I thought we had a good chance to, to take the break. Yeah. Um, thinking about you know, uh, being a team, obviously there was a strategy involved. Mm. What sort of strategy do you, do you guys employ as a team? Yeah, so because we were four guys in our team, one of the guys not feeling so lacquer, um, so yeah, we just needed to make sure that if there was a breakaway, at least two of us, myself and other uh, Yaku van Dijk was in the break. It was a blessing that myself, Yaku and Kasper were in the break. And uh, yeah, from there our strategy sort of fell into place, me doing a little bit less work in the breakaway, and the other guys absolutely destroying themselves for me to win the race. So yeah, I'm very grateful for that. Where do you see the sport taking Yeah, so... Uh, that's a tough question. I work a full-time job still in the pharmaceutical industry. So for me, this is, I love being competitive. I love racing and I love putting myself through a bit of pain. So for me, this is my, I feel like I'm not comfortable, but this is where I will sort of see myself. But for the rest of my team, uh, it's such a good setup with Honeycomb. The goal is to get the guys overseas. So uh, last year we had Mark Fritzen heading overseas riding for a, a European team. So yeah, that's the end goal for the team. Um, you guys put your bodies in the line for the top speed. I mean, the proceeds from this event. I got my The proceeds from this event go to Richard Nixon. We all know the deal with the Tina Lagrange and all of that. What sort of music do you like to send to the other members of the city? Yeah, I think me being from this area, this is the music that I like to send to the other members of the city. Yeah, I think me being from this area, there's such an appreciation from the community that we can get together, pay the entry fee. There's not many races like this. I mean, there's a big turnout. So yeah, we're very grateful. We keep on uh, pitching up for these sort of races, raising the money, and yeah, the money goes a long way. I'm sure. So yeah, we're grateful that we can play a part in that. Thank you very much.